you're a real contender on this race. How are you feeling about this year? Real good. Feeling positive. We all know who the guy is to beat. And uh, for me personally, I'm not worried about him. I'm worried just about taking care of myself and my dogs and uh, creating some magic. Now, talking about magic, you always have some rubber service to pull out of your back pocket. What are you thinking of today? Um, there's only one hue, and we're going to do what we're going to do. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, yeah, Bobby Service and uh, folks like him are the reason I uh, got into the North, you know. They, they uh, <laughs> describe this country and this land better than anyone. And uh, now I'm actually tied in with uh, an education association from Alaska that we promote reading with school kids all over the country and primarily in the villages in Alaska. You know, the kids uh, in the North... There's a lot of uh, high dropout rate, right, unfortunately, and so we're trying to get kids to realize that, you know, knowledge is power. And without reading books and studying and learning, I wouldn't be here today. That being said, though, you know me, I got a lot to learn still. <laughs> <laughs> you do, you do. <laughs> but we all do. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're all human. Yeah. Well, that's great. So, and you're just getting out there, you're going to look after your dogs, and you're going to just run the race that you can race this year. You know the trail so well. It's Anything funny, you, you know, I used to, I used to, on the drive here, I was like, man, I got a young team. And then we started counting the dogs, going, okay, which dogs have actually done this race? And then we realized, you know, we got 10 dogs that have done this race, so they might be young, but they're veterans. And, uh, you know, dogs are a lot smarter than humans as far as remembering where they've been. And uh, my, uh, unfortunately, a tough issue with us when we decided yesterday is we're actually leaving Annie, our pretty famous leader, behind. We're going to save her for uh, Iditarod. She got a little bit of frostbite in one of her flanks from uh, Race in Bethel we did a couple years ago, or a couple weeks ago. Um, 70 mile an hour winds, wow. it was brutal. So uh, 20 below. So uh, we're going to leave her behind, but we got all her pups. We call them Annie's Army. There's uh, seven three-year-olds. And uh, you'll see at the starting line, they're, uh, they're beautiful. And uh, their grandpa's Larry from Lance. And uh, they got Annie's energy and Larry's wisdom. Hopefully. Oh, yeah. right on. They're, Thanks so much for your fun. time. Yeah. Hey, I can keep talking. Don't let me go. I want to keep talking. Where's my coffee? <laughs>